Hey family. I'm just a little busy being in the closet today. Um I wanted to change around my closet because y'all know I've been shopping for clothes, 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 and I got so many clothes or whatever, and I need space. So at one point in time I didn't need both shelves in my closet. Come on. Mm -hmm. I, at one point in time, I didn't need both shelves in my closet, yeah. both racks. I got two layers of racks. And now I need mm. both layers. <laughs> now I need both racks. So, I liked how I had it set up, but y'all know how I be. As you start adding, 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 adding to a certain area, it's just never going to be what you wanted until everything has its home, its designated space. That's just me. So everything has its home and its designated space. So I'm probably going to keep on changing, keep on changing, keep on changing until I get everything how I want it because this room has been several things already. I used to have my nail tape in here doing nails and I figured that I couldn't sleep with the smells and fumes and stuff in this room. So I had to take that out. I had my little office area set up in here. I ended up moving that because I really didn't need it as much then i got into arts and crafts and i got a table in here for that and it's already been my closet my makeup area getting dressed like all that right there and above so i'm trying to make it work for me and what i needed to what i needed for so until it actually all come together and i stop figuring different things that i want to put in my room and add to my room and all that i just have this little square this little box it's a big it's a big size though that i'm working with and i'm and i'm i'm just the type of person where i don't like it to look cluttered but everything has to have its home and it has to be functional and i'm the type of person i like to see my stuff because if i don't see it it don't get used so yeah so i'm changing it again all right so i forgot to show y'all what it looked like before because i went ahead on and moved my table but i'm gonna show you i only moved two things so you really ain't gonna miss nothing only thing i moved was the long table that i have right here and this long table here was actually up against this wall right there and then this container i moved that and it was actually over in that corner right there so this is what i'm working with so far i'm thinking i may just keep this as my crafting um cabinet shelf whatever my crafting little area where i put all my stuff and then now go this way we have my makeup table and then my closet see i have to move this dresser out of this closet because i now i need to use this bottom rack so i can hang more clothes i don't want to tear my closet down again so i need another rack for all the clothes i got and then my mirror that's here, so we can't block that. I got my dresser here with my little TV on it. I'm figuring that I want to keep that there for the moment, for the time being. I'm guessing that's what I want to do. Um, But, yeah. So, I'm not really going to be doing too much changing. Okay, so then over here, I also have my shoe rack and my rack that I keep my clothes on. So, I do want to keep my shoe rack and I definitely want to keep my clothes rack right there in that corner because... It makes it where it's not moving because when it gets too heavy, it falls over. And so I need that to just stay in one spot that we don't have to keep worrying about it. And my shoes, I like to just see them out because that's just, to me, it give it that closet look. By my shoes being out, I can see my shoes. I can easily access them and all of that. I don't want my shoes in the closet. Maybe I don't. But I did think about maybe. <sighs> taking my shoe thing down and stack them into maybe like three and fours and then put it in the closet. But I don't know how that's going to work because I really don't want my shoes slid all the way over in the corner of the closet and then I'm not going to see them and then I may not wear them. However, I just want, I like to see my stuff. I like to see it. So let's change this room around and see what I come up with. I forgot to ask, are you the type to change your room around all the time? Do you, do you, are you the type of person where you ain't going to quit until it's like you want it? Leave a comment down below and let me know if you that type of person or it just don't bother you. Let me know. Like, 
to me, everything have to have a home. That's how I look orderly.
so far here's the setup I got. I got my dresser out of the closet. I got the table here in front of this window. That's my crafting table. My makeup table over there. My shoe rack. My clothing rack still there. I put my stand right here. My dresser still there. I'm trying to decide if I want to leave my dresser here or not. The reason why I'm leaving my dresser is because I'm thinking about if I was to plug in my TV. So, I don't know. I may not even worry about the TV right there. And I don't know if I should find another spot for it or what, but I don't know. Let's keep going. Alrighty, y'all. So, I got another setup. So, coming into the bedroom, once again, the shoe rack is back over here. My thing is stand though. Like I told y'all, I wanted to stay there because it is in a good, stable place. Then I put my makeup table here, right there, because it's a socket that I wanted to be able to access the socket. And also over here at my crafting table, I put that over here towards this corner here. That way I can access the socket there. Then I moved my dresser there. And I think I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna use that for my purses because this is what I'm gonna use for my purses, like what I bought it for for the get go, from the get go. So I just looked at it and I was like, hmm, I only got really two shelves of crafting stuff. So I'm just going to move the crafting stuff probably over to my crafting table or however I may set that area up for my crafting stuff. I might try to find something tall and skinny to put up against this wall right here. They where I could put my paints on or something, you know, for my little crafting area. However, um, I'm getting it together now. I'm liking the way that it's looking. And then I always wanted me a little island, right? In my bedroom. But I can't get an island island. But what I have done, I took my dresser, pushed it right there. I'm going to put some across it to hide this side. Took me a rug, ran it down through there. Now I got my dresser. All that is nothing but my clothing area. And I like it like that. Because the island out in the floor wasn't going to work. Especially with me want to still be able. Excuse me, y'all. But still want to be able to use my mirror here. So, I think this right here is going to work. Then I was like, I'm thinking about buying me. We're going to see. But getting me like maybe a little round or something to sit on right here and just put that in the middle of the flow and let that be for my little seating for when I'm putting on my shoes and stuff like that, getting dressed instead of having a couch in here like I did the last time, you know. And then it could just push to the side out of the way if I want to or however. But I think that's what I'm gonna do like some kind of an ottoman or whatever. But I'm liking this little setup so far how I done did it so I'll be back to show y'all the finished look of it alrighty y'all my closet is now finished and I am about to give y'all a look at everything and how I did it it is totally different from what I was doing with y'all I just had to get my my thoughts together get everything together get what I wanted up in here together and it has come together in the way that I wanted so here is the reveal of my new walk-in closet. When you come in, we have, I have the mirror here and this is my little runway here. My little dressing area, I just say my little dress. <laughs> but into whatever I want it to be. And on the wall here, I just I didn't put a certain placement for my pictures because I know I'm going to be adding different pictures and stuff like that. But my paint is definitely is going to be a part of it. So I got my purses here. The ones that smaller, long strap, excuse me y'all. I am like really <laughs> uh, at home looking <laughs> in my robe and my scarf. But into them. So over here I have my I have one rack and my purses and my mirror on the wall and so we have this little area when you first walk in and I'm still looking for me some rugs that I want so yeah I don't have any rugs so then here's the shoe rack 
right here and I took the one that I had and this the new one that I bought that I did on the Ross vlog with y'all and I just stacked them both together to make it taller for my shoes and then as we pan around this way I have my shelf here with my purses like so I changed the color of the curtains. I just wanted it girly looking. And this is my little crafting area here. I just have this box here still because that's gonna be the box for um, my Christmas stuff when I pack it up, if I pack it up. But yeah, this is my crafting table. At the moment, it have a space, so it's gonna stay. And yeah, so then over in the corner, I have another clothing rack and my makeup table there my little office supplies another dresser with my clothes and everyday stuff that we use right there then over this way is my closet and so I got my clothes hanging and then right here is my jewelry display which I don't have my jewelry on here all my jewelry on there as of yet but this is my jewelry display and this is what i had got from walmart at that time when i was telling y'all that i was gonna do something with this well this is it i don't know if it's gonna stay red because i'm thinking about painting i did <laughs> try to cover it but too much work so i was like uh-uh i think i'm gonna see if i can paint it and see how that work out so yeah i'm gonna be using that for my jewelry and then here let's go back some okay so i've always wanted an island in my room but the island wasn't going to fit for how it my room is set up but it fits the way that i put it like this that way it gives me somewhat of a runway like on this side and then so i got my dresses facing each other and then this here is my island this is my island and I love it, y'all. I love it. And then I have me a little chair sitting here. So when I put my shoes on and stuff, I need to get dressed. And I set my little chair there. And yeah. So that's my chair to my makeup table. Excuse the little makeup. <laughs> And so then I have me another one here, another shoe rack here with my tennis shoes and stuff on it. That sits there. And my crafting bin. And yeah, y'all, this is my closet. This is my closet. So I love it. And you can see if I stand here a certain kind of way, you can see it's full length. But yeah, y'all, this is my closet and I love it. I love it. And I'm glad that I came up with this little design for myself. Here's more of my little paintings and pictures and stuff. I think I'm going to just put all my paintings on one side. I don't know. Do something. But I'm going to put me some pictures around in here. I like, I like, I just like, I just love my closet, y'all. I just like how I came, how I just designed it. So, like, it just all came together for me. I know that I wanted two clothing racks, though. So, I'm glad that I found a way to fit the two in here perfectly for me. And, yeah. And so, then, at night or when the sun goes down, all right, I have some lights and they change colors but I've already had these lights in here because it was already my closet it just wasn't closeting like it's closeting yeah no and it change colors change colors I got and I love it. That's red, that's green, that's blue, that's white, orange, 
purple. They got all kind of colors, y'all. And I think they can flash. Can they flash? Oh, right there. That's flash. Slow. Then they can make it flash slow. I'll make it flash quick. So yeah, y'all. So yeah, y'all, that's my closet. If y'all like it, y'all make sure that y'all leave this video a thumbs up. Rain the doorbell, hit the thumbs up, the like button, that is. And also, um, leave a comment down below and let me know what you think about it. If you felt inspired or whatever. But until the next video, this your girl, Tina, not going to be me. Y'all be blessed. And I will see y'all in the next one. Peace out.